In this lesson, I'll be teaching you how to identify cis trans isomers. Question one reads, identify each of the following as cis or trans isomer and give its name. Beginning with A, we have a double bond right in the middle here. And we have these two halogen groups that are attached to this double bond. Because both of these substituents are on the same side, this is a cis isomer. So when we name this molecule, we say cis, and usually it's italicized if you're typing it, cis, and given that we have bromine and chlorine, these two substituents, we start naming from alphabetical order. So we'll say that this is 1-bromo, 2-chloro, and it's a two-carbon molecule, so we end with F that's the prefix for two carbon molecules cis one bromo two chloroethene now let's move on to B we have this double bond right here and unlike before this substituent and this one which we call alkyl groups are found on opposite sides of the double bond whenever you have that then it's a trans isomer so we'll write down trans and we will begin numbering this from the left side because that's where it's closest to the double bond. One, two, three, four, five. And the double bond exists at carbon two. So trans two, and it's a five carbon chain, pentene. Trans two pentene. One last example, and for this one, pause the video and see if you can do it on your own. And if you've done it correctly, you should end up with the following name. So first we have the double bond right in the middle, so it doesn't matter where we start from the left end or the right end of this molecule. And we have this alkyl group and this alkyl group attached. They're on opposite sides, so it's a trans molecule. Trans, and we'll start from the left side, doesn't really matter. One, two, three, three. The prefix for this one, two, three, four, five, six carbon molecule is hexene. So the answer is trans 3 hexene. And that's all there is to it. If you have any questions, please use our website or leave a comment below and we'll gladly help you.